Hello! Today I want to show you how easy it is to add effect shots to your photos using the Effectio app on an iPhone. Once you've selected and downloaded an effect shot from the store, it should show up in your library. Tap on the icon to open it. I'm going to open the Dragon Breeds Fire. You will notice on the upper left corner that the photo mode is selected. You can change the mode by moving the slider to the left for photo and to the right for video. Tap on the camera icon on the upper left corner next to the library button. Now you can either take a photo from within the app or select one from your photo library. Here I'm going to select photo library. Today we're going to use only the quick controls to create a photo with our dragon. First I'm going to tap on play to see the animation. I can choose any frame of the animation for my photo. I just click on the pause button to stop at any time. If you prefer, you can also select the frame by tapping and sliding the scrolling bar. Now that I've selected a frame of the animation, I want to make some adjustments. First, I want to make the dragon larger. To do that, I use a pinching out motion on the screen. If I want to change its position, I make sure that position is selected in the wheel on the left-hand corner of the app above the Quit Controls icon and then I just drag the dragon with my finger. To rotate it, I go back to the wheel and select Rotation. Once Rotation is selected, sliding your finger on the screen will rotate the dragon. If I want to move the shadows, I select Light Direction using the wheel. Sliding your finger across the screen will now move the shadows. Once I'm happy with how the dragon looks in my background photo, I click on the export button on the right bottom corner of the app. This allows me to export the photo directly to Facebook or Twitter, send it via email, or save it to my photo library. I'm going to save it to my photo library. In a few easy steps, you have now created an amazing photo to share with friends.